TV. I'm your host, Alex Clark. And I'm Xavier Spinsby. To start off today, we're going to send it over to Cody with the elementary interviews. Hello. Hi. What's your name? Theo Johnson. Theo Johnson? Yep. All right. What grade are you in? Can you hear me? Yeah. What grade are you in? Third. You're in third grade? That's pretty cool. <clears throat> What's your favorite thing about school? Art. Art? That's pretty fun. What are you learning this week? Fractions. Fractions? How's that going? Good. Oh, that's good. Do you have any plans for the weekend? Um, what? Did you say something? No. Oh, okay. Well, do you have anything fun happen that, this week? Redoing our attic, and I get to help. Help me build. Well, that's pretty. That's gonna be fun. So, well, you have a fun weekend, and I hope you have fun doing your attic. So, take care. Hello. Hi. Wh Hi. What's your name? Sabella. Sabella. All right. Mm -hmm. Hi, Sabella. What What grade are you in? Second. You're in second grade? That's pretty fun. Who's your teacher? Miss Smith. Miss Smith. Oh, that's pretty cool. What's your favorite thing about school? You get to play with your friends at recess. You get to play with your friends at recess? That's pretty fun. What do you guys play at recess? I just play with other kids and stuff. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. What is something you learned today? Um, we're, we're learning beans, like dolls. Hmm, all right. Um, oh, so what are you going to be doing this weekend then? You got any plans? You don't know what you're going to do? Just going to figure out as it goes? That, that's pretty good. Did you have anything fun happen this week? What? Did you have anything fun happen this week? Mm. Well, oh, um, it was over the weekend, but I got to, like... I got to make clay dolls. You got to make clay I dolls? Like, hmm. I'm making like clay dolls like when we already passed away and it's supposed to be a remembrance. Oh, that's nice. Well, I hope that you have a good weekend and have fun in school. Thank you. Hello. Hi. Hi, what's your name? Claire. Mm -hmm. Hi, Claire. How's your week going? Good. Good. What grade are you in? First grade. You're in first grade? That's, that's pretty fun. What are you learning in first grade? Um, math. Math. What are you learning in math? Anything spe specific? Like what? Like, kind of hard stuff. Oh. Well, I hope it becomes easier for you. Because math is important. So, what are, you, what are your plans for this weekend? Um, FaceTiming my best 
Oh, well, that's fun. And playing with my American Girl doll. Okay. You like playing with your American Girl doll? Yeah. That's fun. Uh, anything fun happened this week? Um, checking that if they have any baby lambs. Checking to see if you have any baby lambs. That's fun. Did you have any yet? Um, we have a lot already. You do? Do you like having baby lambs? Yeah, they're cute. They are? I don't think I've really ever seen one on person, so. But, well, I hope you have fun with the baby lambs this weekend, so. And you have a fun weekend. Welcome back to HGTV, and now over to the Sports Channel with Alex Clark. Starting off with the Lady Patriots, they won against Sally Buttes, then they lost to Falkton, and then they won against James Valley Christian. And then for the boys, they won, they won against James Valley, and then they lost to Sally Buttes. And that's all we have for the sports program today. Keep up the good work, everyone. And now over to Xavier with the calendar. Alrighty, and to start off, today is Thursday the 4th, and there is a wrestling, it is a quad at Redfield. And then over to Friday, there's no school for staff or students. Saturday, there's boys and girls basketball at DeBrook at 2 p.m. And then we move all the way over to Monday at 6 p.m. There's a junior high girls and boys basketball against Highmore Herald at Tulare. Then there will be a boys and girls basketball game at Highmore Herald on Tuesday. This will be at 4 p.m. Moving on to Thursday, there's a school board meeting, boys basketball versus Iroquois at Hitchcock along with girls basketball. And then for 6 p.m. there's wrestling at Millbank. To end the week off on the 12th, which is a Friday, it'll be Lincoln, Lincoln's birthday, and there'll also be enhancement that day for any student falling behind. And that is everything for the calendar. And now for the science fair results. In third place, we have Harley Nielsen, and she did effect of music on plant growth. And then in second place, we have Daniel Knoll and Bethany Wiebe, and they did Does Mint Gum Help Your Focus? And then in first place, we have Kyle Hamilton. What type of milk creates the most mass for case and plastic? Good job to, all, to you three people, and keep up the good work. Mm -hmm. Now over to Sydney with the FCCLA. Thanks, Alex. Uh, my name is Sydney Maynard, and I am the F Hitchcock Tuller FCCLA chapter president this year. So I just wanted to give a little rundown of what we're doing for next week because it's National FCCLA Week, February 8th through the 10th. So Monday, um, I'm going to make a morning announcement about kind of what is going on just to get the students excited and ready. Tuesday, um, the FCCLA chapter is going to make muffins for breakfast for everyone 7 through 12. So. When the students walk into the building, they can come and have some nice breakfast. Um, Wednesday, um, everyone that wears red to support FCCLA will receive a treat at lunch. We have banana bars and brownies, so make sure you wear red. And then Thursday, we are delivering our crush for a crush that we did for a Valentine's Day fundraiser. And that morning, the FCCLA members will get a breakfast in the fax room, courtesy of Mrs. Johnson. We will also be asking trivia questions each day at lunch for both um, lunches. And if you guess the question right, you get a cherry dilly bar, which is red for FCCLA. So yeah, we have a really up, uh, exciting upcoming week and we hope that everyone is excited and participates. Thank you, Sydney, for informing us about the FCCLA week. Now over to our birthdays, starting off with Bentley Knoll. And then we have Blaze Binger. Max Gilbert. And then we have uh, Chandler Schultz. And then Layla Flea. Then uh, Kylie Nock. And then we have Lucas Hughes. Lily Hughes. Clayton Heisinger. And that is everyone for the birthdays. We appreciate you guys taking the time to watch HGTV. I hope to see you guys again next week. Have a good one.